Today I'm teaching you guys three skills that have been done by pros during warm-up. So why would you want to learn these skills anyway? It's not like you can use them on the field. Well, ultimately, it will give you better ball control and you'll get to know your body better. Also, it's a good way to stand out in a warm-up or if you get featured in like a YouTube compilation or something. Or if you're like me and you just want to have fun. All right, so let's just jump straight into it with number one, the reverse toe bounce, which is exactly what it sounds like. It is a toe bounce, but it's in reverse. So a toe bounce looks like this, and a reverse toe bounce looks like this. So all you need to do is kick the ball up to your side, and then you're gonna cross your legs and put your foot on the ground and anticipate exactly where the ball is gonna land. And when the ball is on its way down, you need to lift this leg and go around the ball and let the ball bounce on your toes and give it a little nah, touch up like that to make it go higher. And ultimately it will look like this. And number two, we got the knee stall, which is in theory, possibly one of the easiest tricks out there. But when you try it out, it's harder than you think. All you need to do is keep your knee and your thigh level at all times. And that in and of itself, is pretty difficult because your standing leg needs to be stable at all times. And when you're in this position, all you need to do is place your ball on the knee and there you have it. That's the knee stall. So all you need to do now is to learn how to get it from foot stall up to a knee stall. And if you want to learn some variations like that one, let me know in the comments down below. Third and final trick for the day is the hamstring rainbow. And a rainbow is ultimately a trick where the ball goes over your head, just like all the jokes I tell J Mike at the office. So all you need to do is you start at a knee catch, pull your shorts up a little bit in order to catch the ball in the hamstring catch. Now pull the ball forward and clinch the ball together between your calf and your hamstring. Now to get the ball over your head, you need to release the ball and extend your leg and lift your heel as high as you can in order to get the ball all over your head. Okay, so you start with the ball in between your knees, you get your shorts up, put the ball in front of you, clinch the ball between your calf and your hamstring, release, extend, and lift your heel up, and that is how you do the hamstring rainbow. Easy, but impressive. So that was it for this video, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, leave a like and a comment down below on what trick or what player we should cover in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe with the bell notifications on and check the playlist here down below. And with that said, see you guys in the next video.